Mabuhay! Great day guys! Welcome to TSA Toy Stash in Action with another toy review and I'm Ranger Dave and today we are gonna check out the Transformer Siege War for Cybertron Trilogy Ironhide figure by Hasbro. That is right guys, so Ironhide has become, you know, one of the fan favorite uh, characters for Transformers. I'm totally happy that we have him here and I'm so excited to check him out. So let's get to it. Okay guys, so here is the box for the Ironhide figure. As you can see, you got the logo for Transformers, Takara, Hasbro, and all of that Siege, Ironhide, whatever. You got a bunch of logos right here at the front and of course, uh, the window that the figure comes with. You got a beautiful artwork right here for Ironhide. I mean, look at that. He looks awesome right here there and going here at the back you kind of have the product right there so product shot siya so maganda rin and then of course uh, you got the battle masters your battle minicons nila and you know bunch of stuff you don't read don't read and you got artwork right here so enough about the box let's go ahead and check out the figure all right guys so here he is outside the packaging he's already on his uh, you know vehicle mode or like a uh, cybertronian a vehicle van uh to be honest guys this is one of my favorite transformers uh, of this uh, siege line that hasbro has released go on i mean look at that uh this is a very new and different take for ironhide i like it the detail is amazing you kind of have that scuff marks right there so these are painted details i like that okay because it's like a battle damage and you kind of feel that it is a little old uh going here for the side again yeah, and then you got all scuff marks right there more right here for the top so that is just awesome uh the battle damage feature or like the paint job uh for scratches is amazing i like that and the wheels do roll all right so if i'm gonna take the box and you know just uh, let you see yeah, and so uh, they do roll okay so okay lang din siya uh, I guess it's a little bit uh, you know a different right here for the front because it wiggles but other than that guys uh, this is an amazing piece okay guys now for a quick look for the accessory of course uh, Ironhide comes with his shotgun or slash missile gun I don't know what it's called but it's Cybertronian I love the scuff marks right here yeah and so uh, this is painted so that is just cool because uh, mostly hindi talaga siya painted and I also hate uh, you know the fact that it, this is a little hollowed yeah, and so I wish it was like a full uh, Detail like this yeah. but other than that guys This is a pretty decent gun and it actually transforms if you flip that uh, into an axe yeah, and so I guess this is like a missile launching axe, you know, but yeah, that's dope You can also use this, uh, you know axe with your iron hide figure All you need to do is just you know put it back on shotgun mode something like that and then you can Apply it right here for the ports and of course you got the gun right there that actually it's not bad looking Yeah, so you can add that for playability, but you know, uh, it still looks silly So I'm gonna remove it. All right guys, so let's go ahead and transform Ironhide All right, so Ironhide is way easier to transform than Optimus Prime. So let's get to it guys so here he is on robot mode you know Ironhide himself he looks dope all right so he actually looks dope and I like it yeah and so maganda siya so I'm gonna focus the camera so that we can see the detail better okay there you go so maganda siya I love the head all right so it's okay yeah medyo may uh, angle siya dito or like an attitude face he looks he looks great all right so I love that head sculpt right there uh, the body uh, feels like Cybertronian. It doesn't feel like yung kagaya ng classic na look ni Ironhide. But it's okay, alright? For me, it's okay. I don't know uh, for the others that prefer their Ironhide figures like uh, more on the straight on the G1. I like uh, the Cybertronian looks for these Transformer figures. I don't know, parang bago instead of just your regular stuff. And then going here for the legs. And so you got the, you, you, it's still here guys, the bulkiness of Ironhide is still here. Though I do feel that parang mas maganda if yung mga scuff marks dito sa 
bandang baba. Uh, they have it uh, all over the you know the entire figure itself. He looks clean right here, but you know. Uh, it is what it is, so I'm still happy about it. Alright, so let's go ahead and check out the articulation for Ironhide. So for Ironhide, you got a bow joint right here for the head. You can move it side to side very nicely, up and down. It does tilt a little, yeah, so okay lang. And then going here for the arms, you can rotate it 360 if you like. You could raise it up about this much, yeah. And it does have bicep swivel right here, a single jointed uh, you know, elbow and it can swivel here at the wrist. So, maganda yung articulation niya sa arms. Uh, going here for the upper torso, uh, really none. You got a waist articulation, yeah, so it does swivel here at the waist. Yeah, so that's okay. He can do the splits. Yeah, and so that's a far split right there. That's really cool. You got a thigh swivel right there. You got a single jointed and knee. Yeah, and so that's as far as it could go. And of course, you got ankle pivot, I guess. Yeah, and so ganun nun talaga siya. Alright guys, so just for fun, here's a quick size comparison with our Siege Ironhide figure. Alright, so we got here the MFT, uh, you know, uh, third party Ironhide. And of course, our Ratchet. This is from the Transformers Prime now. Uh, he, he can actually fit with all of your you know Ironhide figures yeah, and if you are collecting like just Ironhide but you know uh, if you like uh, the transformation for the Cybertronian mode I totally recommend this figure but if you are like on this uh, version just don't pick it up but other than that guys you know uh, this is the size, you know, he's not too big, he's not too small, but he is bulky, so he's actually awesome. And I almost forgot to mention that you can use uh, the, you know, the weapon right here. I already formed it as an axe so that it can fit here on the arms. Now, uh, pag ginamit niya ng parang barrel, medyo mahihirapan siya kasi dito sa scalp ng hand, right? It's too, uh, too, like, a box, so hindi siya masyadong mag-work. But other than that, guys, that is just completely beautiful. Alright guys, so that's my take for the Transformer Siege War for Cybertron Ironhide figure by Hasbro. I totally love the sculpt, the paint job, and of course just the beauty of this figure. Now if you are looking for a Cybertronian mode Ironhide, this is the figure. I'm still gonna give this figure guys a 4 out of 5 rating. And if you are new to the channel guys, please do hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell to be updated on every new video we have here. That wraps it up guys. Remember, like Life is one big collection. Peace out. God bless.